guys, it is 6 o'clock in the morning and the sun is rising. We got concrete at 6, but it's not coming at 6. It must be coming at quarter past 6 or something. Looks like an alright day. Bit of cloud out there. But um, we're good to go. Five pizzas, eh? Let's check them out. I had some of them on the weekend. Awesome, I'll show you my wood fire pizza in a minute. <laughs> Alright, we're up. Boys are ready. Ready for action. We're going down here. Just to there. This is good. Play some more mesh. We're going crossways, remember? Yeah, it should be alright. We've got Ricey Bedford here and Maddie. Two new fellas to help. Good times. Concrete is here. It's about a quarter past six. The sun is up. Let's go. Let's get this in. Let's see how fast we can do it. Time lapse.
10 to 7. And we got rid of one truck already. And then um, work our way down here now. Around the corner a bit. Down the hill. We're away there. Need some pads over there. Alright, I thought I'd put this on time lapse so you can see nearly all of the driveway getting put in. Just remember when you're going down the hill to keep the concrete high behind you. Because it's going to fall and doing exposure, you don't want to tear apart because you'll have misses. With no rocks in there. Just did that part. We're going to go around the, the side here. Got Josh on the truck. The mud was pretty good today. It was awesome. You want to pour it a bit drier when you're on a hill. Having the two young guys, Royce and Matt, were a lot better helping me. Made it a lot easier. But... All right, that was that bit. Then time lapse around the corner there. Royce is having a go on the screen. Royce, one of the people taught me how to do exposed concrete back in the day. And also, Royce is the guy that I invented my first invention for. My stick board. So I made a board for his 21st birthday. And, um, yeah. And it went from there. You right, Royce? Bullfighting Royce's part where he screeded. Always bullfight up the hill if you can. Especially with exposed concrete, if you come down the hill, you can actually pull the rocks apart. Johnny? Huh? Oh, 
about the Rockies, are they here? No, oh, well, I haven't seen them. Twenty to eight. So, it's an hour and a half, so so far. But the big driveways all happen. All the way up there, fuck yeah. It's all done down here. Just waiting for a plus. See how far we go. See how far we go on the plus. Dave's on a sticky. Picking it up already. So what my dad is doing is just um, Johnny's on the edges. Leave all the stuff in. You're gonna need tomorrow. You're gonna need. Yeah. This is Matt over here. Yeah. Matt's just a new labourer. Oh, He's been conquering for about a year, I reckon. Oh, you never do. We've seen Royce before. <laughs> oh, we'll probably go down a bit further tomorrow. Tomorrow should be easy. And then we're done. Yeah, because uh, some of the mock bows have come off in a couple of hours. Mm. <laughs> we have been here for. Oh, you've been here longer than me. I've been five times, I've done videos, so. Five times? Yeah. Yeah, so we can't be cool this in six Going down the hill.
Get it for your blood. <laughs> That was that bit. Well, I knocked that off there. But that's the last bit of concrete. I'm just gonna finish this a little bit off. Now you're at the end. Alright, it's quarter to nine. And she's in. Got to see heaps of different screen today again. The bigger the runway. Might come down here and take the shot. Got my thumb now. Today we've got all the top done up here. Looking pretty good. Royce is on the stick trail too now. Beautiful. Have a gloomy day. Not much sunny up today. Just might sit around for a while today. No sun. Run over over the stick trails. Make sure it's all flattened, all the stones are flattened. You don't want to lift the stick trail up too much because you flip the rocks up. You want to keep the rocks nice and flat. And you see some exposure to sharp rocks is because they lift the trail up too much. They flip the stone up. You don't want to flip the stone up. Beautiful work there, Russ. Alright. Because this mud is so sticky, Dave's just spraying a little bit of water on top. You want to close everything up with exposed, you can't leave anything open at all. So a little bit of misty water. I'll do a treat. The concrete's hardened up underneath. It's got no plastic underneath there, so it's the water's getting sucked out into the ground. I'm gonna get some to the top. Remember that was the one I seen with Rice when you were screwing? I seen it. We, we couldn't find it again, but. Right, Matt's washing the tools up. Here's a good help, awesome help. And I'm done. I'm going home. All right, guys, my day is done. Scraped the driveway off. Royce helped me for a little bit. That was about a meter and a half. <laughs> but um, it was all good. That's what I'm here for. It's the screen. But it was good to have Royce and Matt here to help pull back for us and stuff. It's a bit hard for the old fellas and on that hill it's going to be a little bit harder again we've got the screed down the hill some people like the screed up the hill i like the screed up the hill if it's really steep if it's going down the hill it's all right sometimes the concrete's dry enough but i don't like going across the hill but um leave a comment which way you like to go up the hill or down the hill anyway hope you've enjoyed that one that was i think episode five of this driveway we done the setup one that wasn't part of this six part series but it was a part of it really but it wasn't it's a bit of a special but anyway but this one and i think they're going to pull the next the next bit onto it on wednesday and i'm not here so i'm working for lawrence so i might miss out on the last part but i might be here to acid wash it and stuff so we'll get to show you the whole thing at the end thanks for watching guys thanks for sharing the videos and thanks for the comments the last couple of videos have been going awesome because of you guys giving it a nice thumbs up and stuff the more you share it, the more you thumbs up, the more comments, the more it gets shared around. So if you can do that, that's awesome. 
and it was Christine's birthday yesterday. Happy birthday, Christine. She's been an awesome girl for me lately. She's always helped me. She's got me out of a lot of shit. It's always good to have a good woman around you. But um, yeah, happy birthday, Christine, again. I love you, girl. And um, we'll show you a little bit of what we did yesterday for her birthday. Had some pizzas in the in a hot oh, wood, wooden wooden oven, whatever you call it. <laughs> Alright, I'm talking shit now, I'm going by. <laughs> All right, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. This was our weekend. We had wood fire stove for the pizzas. We had the fireplace on inside the house as well. And Christine found out this little hack. Did you know you put the salt on top of a little hat? And then you get your shot glass, put some lemon on it, on around the rim and stick it on the hat and there's your salt for your tequila tequila time happy birthday Christine ah. and this is me kicking Corey <laughs> enjoy